Ahoy there! My name's Dan and I'm one of the producers behind Maker Fair Rochester. I'm also a longtime friend and supporter of the Rochester Museum and Science Center. This April, we get to celebrate a lot of awesome space-related anniversaries. We have Apollo 13, the 50th anniversary of it. We have the 59th anniversary of the first human going into space. And we get to celebrate the four-year mark until we get to experience a total solar eclipse right here in Rochester. April 8th, 2024, save the day. One of my favorite ways to celebrate all things space and astronaut related is by making my own space helmet. And I'm gonna show you how you can make your own at home. So the first one that you can do is by taking a paper bag, drawing a circle on it, and with parents' help, cut it all the way out. And once you have that, you have a nice basic helmet to work with. You can also do the same thing with cardboard, or you can do a different method using lots of different cardboard strips like this, and then just kind of attaching them and making it into a helmet design like the ones we have right here. You can also, you know, once you have the basic helmets, add lots of little details. It really gives it a little nice extra kick. You can outline it using tape or with Sharpie. My favorite is to do different colors of duct tape, like the gold and silver here. It's really cool. The white tape is actually electrical tape. You can draw on lots of little buttons. You can fill the inside with either aluminum foil or duct tape. Or one of my favorite things to do is add in nice little lights, like the two over here, and gives you that nice little extra glow. If you wanted to, you could even add a flashlight to the outside of it so when you go outside it's stargazing, you have a way to see in the dark. In order to make a space helmet, look for anything around your house. It could be fabric, you could use 3D printers, or even lamp parts like the one I have here. Actually, what's fun about this one is the bottom part used to be a bucket. You know, you can even make them out of pie tins or know anything that you go and recycle be creative think about what might make a good space helmet once you do be sure to assemble it and share it with us we'd love to see them so i hope you learned something fun to do today and i can't wait to see you next time remember keep on making